Hey everyone, welcome back to my channel. My name is Tahar and today is going to be a swatch video slash mini review of the Everbelena Advanced Power Paint Set, which is this set right here. It has four shades and these are just four cream tints that look very similar to the Glossier ones. Here are the the tints right here. Don't they look familiar, right? They look like the Glossier ones, but this is like the a fraction of the cost. Before we start the video, don't forget to subscribe, hit that notification bell, and like this video if you did. So yeah, let's just get into the video. Quick review, um, there are four shades. This is Scarlet being the darkest, then Chiffon, Amber, and Sangria. They also have like one warm red tone, one cool toned red, and one warm toned orange, one cool toned orange, which is nice. So I bought this on Shopee and I'll be linking the um, link, I'll be linking the link down below. It did come with two freebies. One is this, um, this makeup case right here. Pretty nice. I like it. And another is the Absolute Matte Lipstick in the shade Perk. And it looks like this. It's, it's, it's a basic lipstick, not the best pigmentation in my opinion. Not like super matte. I actually don't like it very much. Even the color doesn't suit my skin tone. So I will be giving this to a friend. Pigmentation is top-notch. It is amazing. You only need super tiny to get like a big flush of color. You know how you like you prick your finger and then like a little bit of blood, a little bit of blood like gushes out just a little bit. That's almost how much you need. Longevity, it does fade throughout the day. So for example, you put it on your cheeks and then at 8 a.m., at around 4 p.m., it will be a little bit faded. You won't really see so much of the intensity anymore, but it's still gonna be there. The formula is very creamy as opposed to like lip tints, which are more liquid. It is marketed as a cheek tint, but I believe you can use it on your lips, which I have done, and your cheeks. And I know some people use it on their eyes as well, but I just don't like to do that. So this does not transfer on the lips. I do like their packaging. The, the thing is, like for example, Sangria. Sangria does not look like this. So that's the problem, I think. Um, they don't look like how they're marketed in the bottle, which is sad because it would have been very convenient. So I did try four different kinds of application processes. I brush a wet or damp sponge, a dry sponge, and my fingers. Yay! And I find that the best, ultimate best way to put it is with your fingers. The dry sponge and the dry brush, they just seem to like make things so patchy. And I don't recommend using anything dry because it's like they wipe away when you use those. Uh, with a wet sponge, it's kind of, it, it also like, um, like if you do it this way, it tugs a little and it's not the best. But what I like to do is I like to put it on with my fingers and then maybe dab it a little bit to make it look more smooth. And that's, I, I do like it, but for the most part, I just use my fingers. It's all, it's all fine. Okay, so formula-wise, Chiffon and Amber, these are the least patchy of them all. Actually, they're not patchy at all, in my opinion. I do love these two. It really depends on how you apply it on your skin. But these two are beautiful. I love these two. I think I'm biased because they are the lightest ones and my skin is quite light. So yeah. These two, on the other hand, Sangria and Scarlet, they are darker, they are quite intense. And Sangria, you can, make, you can make it work, especially if your skin is a little bit more tan. But I find Scarlet is very difficult, and you will see it in the swatch video later. It was very difficult for me to blend this out and make it more smooth. It did come up a little bit patchy. I did look like I had a rash or something. And I think one of the reasons why is because this is too dark for my skin. And yeah, that's the only problem. It doesn't glide as well as the other three. But I think if you have a darker skin tone, maybe this will work better for you. So I will be swatching these on my arm, on my cheeks, and on my lips. The color I have right now is my favorite, Chiffon. And I just really like this, this color. So uh, yeah, so if you wanna see them swatched on my arm, on my lips, and on my cheeks, then please keep on watching.
have it, everybody. That is the swatch video. I hope you enjoyed and found it useful in any way. Thank you so much for watching. Please don't forget to hit that subscribe button, like this video if you did, and comment down below what you'd like to see next. What's your favorite shade? Don't forget to hit that notification bell to be informed when I upload. And I hope to see you in my next video. Bye!